that was probably the darkest phase of my life i had no solution to my problems and that forced me to shift back to my parents house do you remember all of us as kids were impatient and curious at least i was i wanted everything quickly and i wanted everything the best i remember once in ninth standard i wanted to go to this college outside odisha for a boot camp i went to my dad and asked him dad can i go there and he politely declined he said i can't just randomly spend money anywhere and everywhere and that is when it hit me that i need money i want money because i thought that money is what defines success money is what is needed to impact lives hi guys my name is ayush shukla a 22 year old entrepreneur creator and podcast host and since january 2021 when i founded my company finnet media life has been both exciting and adventurous and now i'm going to talk about how i ended up here managing a team of 8 to 10 people making over 13 crores a year and i have this typical small town story that you would expect i spent all my childhood in this small town in odisha called talchor i was shy and ambiverted as a kid but i was also aware of where i am and i knew what i wanted and what i wanted was to leave this place and as an escape i found dus srcc and what do i need to do that i need to get great marks so i turned all my focus towards studying i did three things studying studying and studying and i scored 97% in my 12 boards top the district but guess what i could not make it to shriram college of commerce and it hit me like a truck i thought i am a big loser but something better than nothing right so i took admission in ba economics honors in delhi university and i realized that everyone around me is smarter than me everyone around me is doing languages courses music and i had no experience in non academics all my focus was in academics because all i was doing was studying and that is when i made the transition from academics to non academics i joined every possible society of my college did whatever work was given to me outshined everyone else and by the end of first year i was given leadership positions i was surprised and i thought i am not as bad as i thought i was and that gave me the confidence to organize events i applied for tedx got the license organized two tedxs in my college that exposed me to a lot of smarter people and trust me the journey from looking at those speakers to being a speaker at the stage is a wonderful feeling through these events like tedxs i started meeting successful people people i never imagined i could get in touch with that gave me a lot of exposure and i thought why not take it to the next level and that is when i started my podcast the many adult troubles it was nothing but an excuse to meet smarter people to meet successful people and learn from them but slowly and steadily that podcast gained traction and that is when it hit me that i also need to feed myself second year was almost ending and i had no source of income that is when i started getting into digital marketing i learned about e-commerce i learned about drop shipping i learned about digital media and i started my own drop shipping store three months down the line i made over 10 lakhs in revenue and i thought i was profitable but it was all on paper i realized i was bleeding money 2 lakhs every month and i immediately stopped the operations but what good happened from that experience was that i got a lot of experience i leveraged that i monetized that and i started freelancing as a marketing associate with different different companies i was freelancing for 3 to 4 companies making 20 25k a month and surviving hand to mouth in a city like delhi college was almost over and i knew that i did not want to do a job but this situation forced me to look at a job i had three job offers so i went to the first one the second one and the third one and guess what none of them worked out for me the first one said that i'm asking for too much the second one did not give me what they had committed and the third one said i am arrogant that is when i hit the rock bottom that was probably the darkest phase of my life i had no solution to my problems and that forced me to shift back to my parents house from delhi to bhopal because i didn't think i would be able to make my ends meet with this freelancing after moving to bhopal i thought let's give this a last shot i asked a few friends and got a job in a edtech company based out of dubai via a reference simultaneously i had started working on my agency 
because I realized that I had good network of creators and entrepreneurs. So why not leverage that and do something about it on the side. And one month after that, in March of 2021, fortunately or unfortunately, I got COVID. And that meant 15 days of no work. And that gave me time. Time to think and introspect on what I want and what I don't want. And I immediately realized that I wanted to be my own boss. I did not want to be dependent on anyone else. And I resigned the next day. And all my focus went to my company, Finet Media. What is Finet Media? Finet Media is an influencer marketing and creator management agency. We believe in enabling creators. I remember in Jan Feb of 2021, we signed this creator called Anushka Rathod. She was in 2000 followers back then. Today, she's at more than 450,000 followers. Then we signed finance with Sharan, famously known as Sharan Hegde. He was at 7,000 in February, April of 2021. Today, he's at more than 1.7 million. And there are more than 10, 20 creators like this in Finnet Media that we have enabled and provided them the resources that they need to be where they are today. And the initial days were crazy, like any startup. And trust me, it was not as smooth as it sounds. Both my parents were mad at me. They were asking me, why are you leaving the stable source of income and doing something unconventional, which you have no experience in? But at that time, I had conviction. I knew this is what I wanted to do. This is what I wanted to pursue as a career. And I just went all in. And the results? All worth it. I made 100x the money, literally 100x the money this January as compared to last January. In terms of numbers, Finnet Media clocked 13 CR in the last 10 months of operation. To all those people out there who want to do something in the content industry, or to the parents whose kids want to be content creators, this is a difficult industry to enter. But this industry is going year on year massively. And this industry is awaiting a lot of technological revolution. If you believe in the digital revolution, then you learn, earn, and grow in this industry. If a guy like me from Odisha can enter this industry and make space for himself, so can you. Click the subscribe button and press the bell icon to never miss a video from Josh Talks. Josh Talks is now a Spotify exclusive podcast. The audio version of our talks will be available only on Spotify. If you like this video and you like to listen to more inspiring stories like this, please follow the Josh Talks podcast only on Spotify.